Today, I want to bring you guys on my week-long journey of doing my juice fast. It's actually called Love Your Liver Cleanse, and it's by a place called Arden's Gardens, which is located in Atlanta, Georgia. But if you are interested in doing this juice fast, I believe you can actually order online and they will ship them to you. educator and as you know I am a special education teacher whose goal it is to share hope and to dispel myths about learning disability as everybody is planning their back to school and doing preparation I am not able to get in my classroom but I'm not letting that stop me I decided to really just do something for me not for my students just particularly for me I'm gonna eventually get to the classroom but I have not been able, or I wouldn't say been able to, I just have not disciplined myself to eat like I really want to eat. And I do not want to start another school year off on the wrong foot. So I decided to do this juice fast. It's actually, well, the it's seven days, but it's only three days of only juices. And I typically describe it as being seven days because there are two preparation days prior to you doing the only juices and then there is two more days to kind of wean yourself back on foods. The first two days they want you to only do fresh juices as well as raw fruits and vegetables and then for the next three days you're going to only do juices and then after that you're going to do fresh juices again as well as only raw fruits and vegetables and then the plan is to eat sensibly after that i have done this cleanse several times um it just requires me to really set my mind to do it and after i really get over the first day or two it's really not difficult whatsoever and actually my productivity generally goes through the roof because i'm not in the kitchen cooking and preparing and a lot of times now i do kind of prepare my family because i don't necessarily want to even have the the temptation of being around all of this good food so i kind of meal prep and plan for them as well anyway let me tell you a little bit more about the juices so here are the juices and i actually have already did my first two days so now i i've already did breakfast which is the um paradise then after the breakfast it is the green energy machine let's see and then this was apple they made that fresh then then you have a multi green let's see beat it better and then all the way back there it is their ph solution so um these are all of the juices that i have throughout the day and basically they all correspond to like times that you would generally eat um and then here is the pure lemon and what you do and i already do this like um in the morning when you first get up you do i think about two tablespoons of this and maybe about 16 ounces of water i have to look at the directions again and you would do that also three times a day. So you would do that morning, midday, and then before you go to bed. So like I said, I've already did the morning. This is my mid-morning snack, and it is the green energy. So I'm going to go ahead on and down this so that my energy level will stay high because there are several different things that I have planned today. And I am going to check back in with you guys a little bit later. Hey, guys. It is like... 10 minutes out the four and I am headed to pick up Aubrey from summer camp. Um, I am still doing very well. I wouldn't say surprisingly because normally, like I said, I've done these before and um, it's the first day that is a booger for me for the most part. And then today, because I started late, I had to go pick up the juices and then I had a visitor. So anyway, I started drinking them late. Um, matter of fact, I left my juice in the house. Gotta go back in. I started a tad bit late, so I've really been playing catch up with drinking. <laughs> a lot of different juices and i must say my absolutely favorite one 
is my lunch juice, which is the red apple. Um, right now, I have to do the multi green. Um, it doesn't taste as good, but you know, I get they over. After the beat. Oops. Um, I quickly get over taste for the most part. So I don't know why I have such an issue giving up my foods. But anywho, so as you can see, I am still up and at them. Um, I even had a little energy, so I got some administrative things done today. Um, paperwork that I had to get in. Um, we're going to be doing the after school program this year. So I got... Um, some marketing material up to or information up to my graphic designer and I even put in a load of clothes I went up to Aubrey's room and started pulling clothes out of her drawer and I'm actually picking her up a little bit earlier because I want to bring her back and we're gonna go through some of those clothes and get rid of them so we can make way for our fall clothes and our fall uniforms and so forth so I'll check back in later I can't have nothing. Okay, that's enough, Lulu. Mommy, how are <laughs> So, hi, guys. Hi, guys. Tell them to like and to subscribe. Subscribe to the channel and subscribe to the... And there's nothing wrong with her forehead. <laughs> so I just dropped Miss Lucy off at camp. Um, I had a little late start to my day, but that's okay. It is day four of the overall juice cleanse, and it's day two of me drinking only juices. Um, it is going well so far. Yesterday, it really went well. I was very productive for the most part. Uh, for some reason, though, I crashed last night. I fell asleep on the couch around ugh, maybe 10 or so. Uh, but I woke up, finished my last juice, and then drank 16 ounces of lemon water. This morning, upon arising, I did 16 ounces of warm water and I, I usually like warm to look water and two tablespoons of lemon juice and I down that and right now I am working on breakfast this is paradise and paradise tastes pretty good although it's not my absolute favorite but it tastes pretty good so I'm working on it now and although I really don't like to do any strenuous types of exercises when I'm fasting um, I decided that I felt well enough that I wanted to go to the park and walk around maybe I'll do a mile or two we shall see of juices only um, tomorrow I will be doing juices and raw fruits and vegetables and actually I will be doing that for the next two days and then after that I kind of go back to whatever I want my normal to be and I think I'm definitely gonna try to limit my meat intake um, do more raw fruits and vegetables and um, I'm doing a little bit more research on intermittent fasting and I think it's basically there's an eight hour period is it an eight hour period that you eat um, only and after those eight hours you can't eat after that and you can't eat before 11 hours maybe it's something like that so I'm gonna do a little bit more research on that I actually had a couple of people who tell me that they've been doing that and they've been seeing great results I'm excited um, about where my journey is taking me now um, because for me, it's always like a mindset thing. It's not that I can't do it, it's just getting in the um, mind frame to do it and then when I do it, it's not that bad. Like this process 
has not been huge. Like I said, I think it was maybe the first or second day. I was a little irritable um, because my body was getting adjusted to not having that Starbucks with my four raw sugars and cream. Um, and I'm so like, I, even now though I think about it, I'm just like, oh, that would be so nice. But I am gonna try to limit my intake of that because I had gotten up to the point where I was doing it once a day. And I don't wanna put that much sugar in my body. I really don't. And then my body doesn't like the results of that much sugar in my body. So anyway, I'm really excited. Right now I'm headed to one of my former students' home. Um, I have some paperwork that needs to get completed that uh, mom and, my, and I have not been able to really get on the, the same schedule where we can meet. So I just finally said, hey, what are you doing? I will come by your house. So anyway, I might check in a little later. So today's my first day being able to eat something. I don't really have long to kind of tell you guys about it because we actually headed into the movie. We're going to see The Lion King. I've heard really great reviews, but it's been a crazy day. So I've, I had a juice. I did some avocado this morning and oh, I'm dropping something. And now, yes, Lula Bell. Oh. Okay. Now we're headed inside to actually see the movie. So I actually just had a salad and I was so hungry. Hey guys, it's day seven, my yeah, last I day. And I am raw. so happy that I've been able to um, complete this cleanse. It has just been awesome. Um, I ate a salad at Mod, which is a pizza place. And obviously I wasn't able to eat pizza, but that's okay because the salad was the bomb. Um, but I am so ecstatic that um, this was an excellent way for me to jump start my system and uh, my goal is to even be a healthier teacher this year and to jump start this school year um, so some of the be benefits of doing this for me has been like the weight loss I couldn't assess exactly how much weight I lost because my scale was broken but like I said I've done this several times before and I've lost up to five pounds I had a girlfriend who lost seven so to be able to lose that much weight in um, such a short amount of time um, safely is awesome also, afterwards, I experience an increase of energy. I'm not as hungry, and it doesn't take as much food for me to um, feel full. So, you know, doing this is just, I think it's a way my, it kind of shocks my system, and it even changes like my taste buds and so forth. So it makes it easier to ease back into doing more healthy things. I definitely think you guys should try it. If you're interested, I will put the link below where you can go and research Arden Gardens. Okay guys, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed, please make sure you subscribe to my channel. All right, have a great day.